Hello, it's me again, uh, Nick. I'm just uh, going through my artwork. I uh, just want to keep on going because it worked when I uploaded it before and it's turning out pretty clear. I don't have my video game uh, CD in right now, but uh, here we go. Let's start with the next page after the after this one that we showed you la on the last video. The uh, mirror. Next one is a bit of a fetish one. Big girl uh, stomping on a little guy. <laughs> and here's one of my uh, favorites. Uh, two frolicking fairies. Uh, one pouring some dew on her and the other one just taking some. <laughs> Yeah, right now the music in the background is Project Pitchfork. Oh, and here start my Orb Goddesses. Uh, it's one of my favorite series of stuff that I've done. Yes, I like body hair, so uh, you'll have to get used to that if you want to look at my art. <laughs> but anyway, this one's the Green Orb Goddess. Go Orb Goddess. Here's the Yellow Orb Goddess, although it looks more orange, but it's supposed to be yellow. Here's the blue orb goddess. I'm kind of proud of that face. And here's my red orb goddess. She's more wild and hairy and stuff. <laughs> There's the purple orb goddess. Although all purple seems to show up as blue on this. Uh, it's just like in the Max picture in my previous video. But anyway, yeah, it's the purple orb goddess. Oh, that's supposed to be purple. Here's the pink orb goddess. And the black orb goddess. Uh, she governs over fear and all that. As you can probably tell. <laughs> and there's the white orb goddess. Of uh, life and giving birth. And there's the final one, the orange orb goddess. Uh, of destruction and all that type of thing. I'm really proud of that uh, that foot, although it's kind of blurry. From here, I wonder if I just zoom. No, I can't zoom the camera. Oh well. And here's one that I was that I really like as well. Is a comp comp combination of imagery from me, my stuff. You know, big women and tentacles. Because I'm a lime green squid, and uh, trees growing out of heads and keys hanging off strings from a friend on uh, DeviantArt as well named swaggertoes.deviantart.com. Her stuff is awesome too. But yeah, again the stuff on her legs and arms, are, the uh, tattoos are supposed to be purple, but they come through as blue on the video. <laughs> Here's another one of those ones that, uh, that I drew a long time ago a version with skinnier muscular women and I just wanted to update it. Uh, just three uh, witch women uh, having a, a ritual floating in the sky on these little pieces of land. There's one there. I like to make sure I have a lot of variety in the shapes that I draw because no two women are shaped exactly the same or have the same uh, sizes of uh, you know breasts or hips or whatever belly. That's a big one of uh, a goddess being awakened and her sister is causing, causing trouble. But I haven't colored that one. It's very complicated and I've been putting it off. Here's a neat one. It's not BBW related, but uh, it's uh, made from lyrics of, uh, inspired by the lyrics of the Mars Volta, one of the greatest bands in the world. Uh, my hands secrete a monument. It's just the image that came to my mind. Hands secreting monuments. <clears throat> and here is my belly dancer ninja. <laughs> thought the idea would be pretty neat. And my version of the Adams Family, uh, <laughs> Gomez and Chubby Morticia, and, uh, all, the, all the rest. Here's an idea that someone wanted me to draw a tattoo for them. Uh, they didn't quite like this design. I know the head looks pretty small <laughs> compared to the body. But uh, I do like how the body turned out. 
that uh, and uh, and the hair. And here is my recent uh, Canada Day uh, drawing. Yes, I'm in Canada and uh, proud of it and lots of diversity and stuff. <laughs> ah, that word is so overused by corporates, uh, corporations and stuff. But anyway, here's another one of my absolute favorites. Uh, obviously, from the Queen song, Fat Bottom Girls. They're making the rockin' world go round by uh, spinning it around with uh, with their fat bottoms. Yeah. Pretty much says itself. And <laughs> that one's a little bit too much for this site. Um, this one is sort of a uh, request of someone, my character Marathka, again, and her character, uh, my friend's character, Lameep, at dot deviant.com. Uh, her character Lily Rose, which is a zombie, <laughs> a very uh, uh, mannered, well mannered uh, Victorian zombie. <laughs> They're sharing a tea together. And there's another one uh, request of someone of a of a goddess, uh, Kytheria Chthoni, or something like that, dominating a goddess. And there was my uh, miscalculation. She's a calculator nerd girl. She's uh, to celebrate my 50,000 views at uh, DeviantArt. I'll probably bring this to a close with a little bit of fan art. Uh, if anyone's played Super Mario, uh, Paper Mario, and the Thousand Year Door, these are the characters from them: the uh, Shadow Sirens, and uh, I can't remember her name right now, but anyone who's played the game should know. And again, yes, I like body hair, so uh, I tend to put it in places. But anyway, uh, again, hope you enjoy, and uh, I'll try to 